now song Zavadi. Thank you for inviting me today. I want to thank Michael Lowe and John Tao for the invitation to speak on this important occasion, the fifth annual Lao Mang Memorial Day, to honor General Vang Pao. Too many times in our nation's history, we have forgotten the heroes who assisted us in our time of need. I was just an infant when the secret war began in Laos in 1962, and just starting high school when it ended in 1975. Unfortunately, many Americans did not understand or know the sacrifices being made by the Lao Mang young boys and men who fought and gave their lives during this secret war under the brave leadership of General Vang Pao. We were not aware of the enormous sacrifices of mothers and sisters and wives as they watched tens of thousands of their own citizens cut down. We did not understand that your precious homeland, home to beautiful waterfalls, lush forests, mountains, and crags, was being bombed at a rate every single day, that it now has the unfortunate distinction of being the most bombed country in the world. We did not understand that people as young as we were then were going off to fight in this secret war. We were not taught about the atrocities of this secret war until years later. And so today, we have the opportunity to honor General Vang Pao. He is like the earth and the sky, a Hmong refugee once told the Fresno Bee. Another article said that General, General Vang Pao was so revered that some of the Lao Hmong people believed he had supernatural powers. According to his obituary in the LA Times, General Vang Pao quickly organized 7,000 guerrillas for the secret war, then steadily increased the force to 39,000, leading fighters in many successful battles, often against daunting odds. William Colby, CIA director in the mid-1970s, called him the biggest hero of the Vietnam War. And Lionel Rosenblatt, President Emeritus of the Refugees International, in an interview with the New York Times, said that General Vang Pao's troops helped save U.S. soldiers from fighting and from dying. This is the very definition of a hero to be remembered. Congressional committees discussed the war in secret sessions at the time it was being fought, and the press uncovered significant details. But the United States government did not officially recognize the Lao Mang's contribution until 1997, when the Clinton administration authorized a plaque at the National Arlington National Cemetery saying that the valor of General Vang Pao's troops would never be forgotten. So today, I stand before you to help Chico and Butte County to never forget about General Vang Pao's legacy or the contributions of the troops he led. We honor the Lao Hmong veterans of the secret war and the sacrifices they made. Kap Jai, watch out.